Arizona DMV Permit Test 3 Question 1. If you are driving on a two-lane road, it is safest to drive your vehicle in the of your lane. Right side. Anywhere. Left side. Center. Answer. Center. Question 2. And is the connection of a freeway to a road or another freeway by a series of ramps? Exit ramp Interchange Entry ramp Acceleration lane Answer Interchange Question 3 which of the following is not a safe situation for passing? When pavement markings or broken yellow lines. When the vehicle ahead is moving below the safe speed. When moving through an intersection. When pavement markings are broken white lines. Answer. When moving through an intersection. Question 4. Making U-turns is not legal in which of the following areas? At railroad crossings. On highways. Near a crest of a hill or in a curve. All of the above. Answer. All of the above. Question 5. Lock wheel skids are usually caused by Drive wheels losing traction with the road surface Pressing the gas and brake pedals at the same time Ignition turn to the lock position while the vehicle is still in motion Braking too hard at a high speed Answer Braking too hard at a high speed. Question 6. This sign cautions drivers that A part of the roadway is made of gravel and dirt. A part of the roadway is curved. A section of the roadway is one way. A section of the roadway may be more slippery. Answer. A section of the roadway may be more slippery. Question 7. When waiting to make a left turn, a driver must Keep the front wheels pointed straight. Keep the front wheels toward the right. Keep the front wheels pointed toward the left. None of the above. Answer. Keep the front wheels pointed straight. Question 8. What should you do if fog closes in completely while driving, and visibility is reduced to near zero? Use low beams. Increase the speed and take a detour. Use high beams. Carefully pull as far off the road as possible, and stop. Answer Carefully pull as far off the road as possible, and stop. Question 9. In heavy rain, your tires can ride on a film of water and lose contact with the road. This hazard is known as Friction planning Water planning, hydroplaning, Rhine planning. Answer Hydroplaning. Question 10 When you approach a flashing yellow light at an intersection, you must come to a complete stop. 
proceed with the same speed. Slow down and proceed with caution. Proceed with an increased speed. Answer. Slow down and proceed with caution. Question 11. If you want to cross several lanes in a multi-lane highway, take them two at a time. Take them with higher speed. Take them with the reduced speed. Take them one at a time. Answer. Take them one at a time. Question 12. Which of the following is not true regarding pavement markings? Broken white lines separate traffic moving in the same direction. Crossing a double solid white line is allowed on a highway. Crossing double solid yellow lines to make a left turn to, from an alley is not against the traffic law. Broken yellow lines separate traffic moving in opposite directions. Answer Crossing a double solid white line is allowed on a highway. Question 13. If you are about to overtake a bicycle and an oncoming vehicle is approaching, you must Alert the bicycle rider about the oncoming vehicle. Alert the oncoming vehicle to slow down. Slow down and let the vehicle pass first. Speed up and quickly pass the bicycle. Answer Slow down and let the vehicle pass first. Question 14. A steady red arrow means You must stop and you cannot go in the direction of the arrow. You should prepare to stop and give the right of way to oncoming traffic before turning. You must come to a full stop and then proceed when it is safe to do so. You can safely turn in the direction of the arrow. Answer You must stop and you cannot go in the direction of the arrow. Question 15. Are the most likely places for car and motorcycle collisions to occur? Intersections Expressways one-way roads Roundabouts Answer Intersections Question 16. When approaching an intersection where there are no signs or traffic lights, you must Yield to vehicles on the left Yield to vehicles on the right Yield to slow-moving vehicles. Yield to heavy vehicles. Answer. Yield to vehicles on the right. Question 17. If there is another driver tailgating you, you should not. Increase your speed. Move to the right lane. Provide more space to allow them to pass. Reduce your speed. Answer. Increase your speed. Question 18. When making a right turn, look right and left, yield right of way, and turn the steering wheel using A hand off hand technique. A double hand technique. A hand over hand technique. A single hand technique. Answer. A hand over hand technique. Question 19. Vehicles approaching a roundabout must 
come to a complete stop and wait until the traffic in the circle is clear. Yield to the traffic in the circle. Enter the roundabout to the left of the Century Island. Enter the roundabout with a speed of 35 miles per hour. Answer Yield to the traffic in the circle. Question 20. If a blind pedestrian is waiting at a crosswalk with a white or metallic cane or a guide dog, you must Reduce your speed and proceed slowly. Use your horn to alert them of your presence. Yield the right of way and take precautions to avoid injury to the pedestrian. Increase your speed and move quickly. Answer Yield the right of way and take precautions to avoid injury to the pedestrian. Question 21 On what way roads, yellow lines are used as? Right edge lines, center lines, left edge lines, stop lines. Answer Left edge lines. Question 22 If traffic from another roadway is merging into the roadway you are traveling on, you must. Sound horn to let the merging traffic know you are there. Change lanes immediately. Ignore the merging traffic since you have the right of way. Adjust your speed and vehicle position to allow the traffic to merge. Answer Adjust your speed and vehicle position to allow the traffic to merge. Question 23. This regulatory sign indicates that Drivers must not pass on the right. Drivers must not yield right. Drivers must not make a left turn. Drivers must not make a right turn. Answer Drivers must not make a right turn. Question 24. Which of the following statements is true regarding lane markings on the road? Two solid lines between opposing lanes of traffic means either side can pass. Where there is both a solid and a dashed yellow line between opposing lanes of traffic, you may pass if the solid line is on your side. A solid white line between lanes of traffic means that you should stay in your lane. Unless a special situation requires you to change lanes. A dashed yellow line between opposing lanes of traffic means that you may not cross the line. Answer A solid white line between lanes of traffic means that you should stay in your lane, unless a special situation requires you to change lanes. Question 25. The danger areas around trucks and buses where crashes are more likely to occur are called Blind spots No passing zones Round spots Empty spots Answer Blind spots Question 26. When approaching an intersection to make a right turn, you must stay and make the turn close to the right curb. As close to the right as possible. As close to the left as possible. In the center lane. On the shoulder. Answer. As close to the right as possible.
Question 27, if a vehicle stalls on the tracks and the motorist sees a train coming, the motorist must Try to start the engine Get out and walk clear of tracks Open all doors and wait for the help Give a signal to the oncoming train Answer Get out and walk clear of tracks Question 28. Drivers on an express highway should avoid highway hypnosis by Keep shifting eyes from one area of the road ray to another Listening to very loud music Continuously talking on the cell phone Keep moving the car from one lane to another Answer Keep shifting eyes from one area of the road ray to another. Question 29. If you are being followed too closely, tailgated, you must Increase the speed to avoid the driver behind you. Tap your horn to warn the driver. Stop your car on the road and argue with the driver following you. Slow down and encourage the driver behind you to pass. Answer Slow down and encourage the driver behind you to pass. Question 30. This arrow mark and an octagonal sign indicate A closed road ahead A stop sign ahead a yield sign ahead A one-way road ahead Answer A stop sign ahead Question 31 When approaching or driving through a work zone, you must not Reduce your speed Weave from lane to lane Watch for slower speed limits. Keep up with the flow of the traffic. Answer Weave from lane to lane. Question 32. Before backing up your vehicle, you should look to the front, sides and rear, and continue to look. While backing To the rear to the sides into the side mirrors to the front answer to the rear question 33 if a pedestrian is in a marked or unmarked crosswalk you must reduce your speed and proceed with caution Increase your speed and cross the crosswalk quickly. Not stop your vehicle. Stop and wait until the pedestrian has passed. Answer Stop and wait until the pedestrian has passed. Question 34 a triangular orange sign on the back of a slow-moving vehicle indicates that The vehicle cannot travel faster than 45 miles per hour The vehicle can travel faster than 25 miles per hour The vehicle cannot travel faster than 25 miles per hour The vehicle must travel slower than 55 miles per hour Answer The vehicle cannot travel faster than 25 miles per hour. Question 35 At an intersection where there is no stop sign or traffic signal, drivers should yield to Vehicles approaching from behind Vehicles coming from the left Vehicles passing straight ahead Vehicles coming from the right 
Answer. Vehicles coming from the right. Question 36. This curved arrow marked sign means a traffic island or a divider ahead, a sharp right turn ahead, a rotary ahead, a winding road ahead. Answer A traffic island or a divider ahead. Question 37 A. Offers you the best possible protection in a car crash and, therefore, is your best defense against the drunk driver. Curved cushion seat. Car sensitive to look at. Safety seat belt. Windshield wiper. Answer. Safety seat belt. Question 38. A sign with an orange background and black letters indicate. A guide sign. A regulatory sign. A service sign. A construction zone sign. Answer. A construction zone sign. Question 39. The shape of the sign represents. Merging on the right-hand lane. A right turn ahead. A one-way street. A no-passing zone. Answer. A no-passing zone. Question 40. Which of the following are used as left edge lines on divided highways? Single, solid, white lines. Single, solid, yellow lines. Double, solid, yellow lines. Double, solid, white lines. Answer. Single, solid, yellow lines. Thank you for watching the video and wish you will get your driver license soon.